Mr. Hamza, we have Fazne Saifullah next. Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum, Sheikh Hamza. Alaikum salam, rahmatullah. You're doing well. Uh, just a quick question for um, those of us who have daughters, young daughters, and, and children. How do we raise them to be like, say, the Maryam, say, the Fatima, and say, the Khadija? Do you have any practical advice? I, you know, I didn't have any daughters, um, so I'm probably not the best person to ask about that. But um, I would say both boys and girls need a lot of mentoring and um, they need real role models. And, and we're in a culture where women are so um, degraded. Uh, it's actually really tragic to see it just how degraded when and one of the worst aspects is the foul women now these kind of women who you know people who pretend to be women who really mock women um there's a kind of over the top feminine quote unquote femininity but it's not real femininity it's it's making fun of women it's making fun of their their nature uh, by being totally over the top and flamboyant um so i mean and then modesty you want to preserve modesty devotion i think stories of the saints is really useful um maryam is a siddiqa um some i mean ibn hajar there there are some of the ulama that considered her you know to have actually have had revelation it's not the dominant opinion but there are ones that do consider it to have had re revelation so that's really important and then the wife you know just I think she's the primary role model for the girls. And then teaching about the wives of the Prophet because they are amazing. Fatima also, uh, the Prophet daughter. He took her everywhere. You know, in the in the Sierra, it's very clear, like he, he always took her to the masjid. Um, one of the things that I loved about uh, traditional Arabic culture is they brought the children to the majlis. I saw that so many times and it really struck. And they brought the girls as well, young girls, before they reached puberty. And they would sit and listen to the, you know, and they had decorum. They would sit quietly. They wouldn't fidget. They wouldn't. It was really beautiful to see that. Um, we have Khalid Thane next. And we are at one and a half hours. 